everybody. It's time again for our superhero, Harold Halibut. Uh, we still haven't gotten Fishy, the alien, on his legs. What else have we been doing? Oh yeah, the, the statue is running out of energy. We don't know what Slippy is doing. He's highly suspicious. Oh, this takes ages today. Oh dear. Doom. I wasn't ready for that. That made me jump. <laughs> Look after Fishy. Okay, let's not try and kill him again, shall we? And go. Run, Harold! Okay, Fishy's little room. It was black there for a moment. I was like, um... What's up, Fishy? Long time no see, huh? Hope you're having fun, Fishy dreams. What if it's a... <gasps> an octopus? <gasps> Did I just... Did I hear you just wheel? It's okay. It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. God, of course they don't understand me. What can I use? A pineapple. A pineapple. <laughs> uh, no. What else? <laughs> don't panic or die. Please. Just wait. Come on, Harold. Think. What's on these papers? I have no uh, idea. Burrow's notes. Nothing I can use. Harold, oh. what are you dithering over? Awake. He said, we you. What? They're awake and attempted to communicate? No, uh, in yes, short. I'm trying to tell them what's going on, but... <sighs> they seem to have fainted again. Harold, you said they said we you. Anything else? And some skis. Skis. Oh, my God. Pineapple notes. Professor, I've got it. Pineapple Helga the Mountaineer. Harold, are you feeling okay? No, he's you not. Something contagious after all. No, Moreau, I could use a picture book to talk to Wii U. I mean, communicate with Fishy. I'm sure Chris will have some at the school. Hmm, not a bad idea at all, Harold. What happened with the pineapple thingy? Too. In the meantime, we're going to need plenty of samples if we're to decipher an alien tongue. What? You can't take their tongue. Oh, Harold. Lots. I mean their language. Okay, but what if they wake up again? Life signs are stable, and I don't think they're going anywhere quite yet. Go on, go. <laughs> what happened with Pineapple Mountaineer? <laughs> okay, ask Chris about the... Are we thinking he is at the school again or is he sitting just oh he's not s hello little friend over there he's not gonna be sitting relaxing because we s that tube is sorted okay okay uh, the bird was fixed last time not really like in social district yes travel in style with all water can water be stylish is it stylish to be flushed down a water tube? Maybe, maybe not. Journey for some reason. Just contact your nearest uh, uh, your nearest fishy? You. Yeah, just interrupt the whole class. Oh, Harold, what brings you here? Chris. He really looked I like I to have discovered uh, I have like dove. Anything in particular? And you do know I have I'm not a found you out. I just need a book. Uh, a kid's book. Like Pineapple Helga the Mountaineer. Well, I'm glad you asked, Harold. <laughs> but maybe you should be challenging yourself a bit. Uh, yes. I will. But I just need to relax. Please, Chris. Hmm. Okay, Harold. I'll bring you one later tonight when I'm done. Ah, no... I really need it now. Harold, uh, are you okay? You seem so stressed. Maybe you do really need a nice book. Okay, I'll get you one now. 
But you'll have to watch the bambinos while I'm gone, okay? Yeah, All of sure. them are gonna Thank be you, gone Chris. when Thanks. you come back. Okay, okay. You sure you're okay, Harold? No, uh, whatever happens while I'm gone, just don't let them under your skin. Okay, Harold, mustache. Don't let them bully you. Wh where is he having the books? Wait. Ciao, Harold. Ciao, bambinos. Don't cause them any trouble, okay? Okay. 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 Decentral now, kids, networks? Are you foraging, construction, oh, you. collecting. Oh, no, I don't know. I'm just doing Chris, I mean, Mr. Tinnebaum, a favor. I have a question. I'm probably not qualified, but I'll do my best. Where do babies come from, Mr. Harold? Of course. Uh, just Harold is fine. And, um, they come from two people. <laughs> Who are my parents? <laughs> oh! It was a choice. I was like, why is this happening anymore? No, I don't mean the two people disappear. <laughs> <laughs> they become your parents. So it could be any two people? I think it's like uh, two people grow you and they give you to whoever's assigned to be parents? Yeah, that's I don't it. know. Uh, I mean, the growing part, not, not the... When will I grow up, Mr. Harold? <laughs> when you take responsibility and help others or... Good question. When you contribute to society. Felix, you'll grow up soon, but... Don't rush it. That's not what I what enjoy I enjoy your youth while you Why chose are you a teacher. Um uh, for many reasons, but mainly because Why does flammable and inflatable mean the same thing? Oh, you know, now you're really teasing him. You're a stranger, and I've always been told not to talk to strangers. Is today's lesson going to pick up from Cartesian dualism or move straight into Neoplatonism? <laughs> Please slow down. Okay. Now, who wants to learn about filter maintenance? There you go, Harold. There you go, Harold. Thanks for holding down the fort. Thank you. This will do great. Hope they didn't give you too much trouble. No. Uh... No trouble at all. Great. Everyone say ciao to Mr. Halibut. Ciao, ciao, Mr. Halibut. Halibut. What are you teaching these kids? And why doesn't this station have a library? Like, what? why does he have to be gone so long to get a, a kid's book? He lives in the lab district. Destination chosen. We hope you enjoy your all water tube system journey. Yeah, I think a library would be one of the first things I created if I were them. You've arrived. In the social district, for sure. People need books and knowledge. Uh, whoop. Okay, Harold. I'm not sure I agree with this. Ah, they've gone back to sleep. Okay. How do you know he's not fainted? Just stay calm, Harold. Radiate calm. Show them the book. Show them you're friendly. Start teaching an alien how to speak my language. Fishy? Wake up. I'm back. Wake up. How do you know if he can see the way you do? Maybe he doesn't see colors, maybe he sees another spectrum. <laughs> he can't see anything while you do that. And I feel like this is a too advanced book. You need like A for A uh, for Apple. What kind of a book is that? By the way, I did look it up. 
all of the scenes, everything you see is handmade and then scanned into a computer. All the fabrics are real fabrics, they're just scanned in. All the figures are made from clay. Isn't that so cool? Oh. Uh, laundry machine sure and a understand. perch. No need. The translation device is ready. Oh. Oh. Okay, let's see. Does it work instantly? Will they understand exactly what I'm saying now? Oh, I can understand you. <gasps> I can understand you. So where am I? Good gosh, I'm glad you're okay. What are you? <laughs> you're on board the Fedora? It's a ship. We're from Earth? Well, well the ship is. Oh, sorry. Um, what's a ship? Oh, sorry. Uh, we're humans. Let don't let Harold talk. He's well, too overexcited. I see you're getting along just fine together. I've got some things I need to take care of urgently. I'll leave you two to it until I'm back. Play nice. I have so, so many questions. Ah. Uh. I'm amazed they are breathing air. Oh! Oh! I hope that was a mistake. A high five mistake. Filter together. Hey, they made it. Boop -a -doop. Okay, how far did that take us? Oh, 61 days left. Two months and a bit. Like, does this alien sleep? They went to the bathroom, apparently. Maybe they live on sunlight and photosynthesis. Wait, do we have any tasks? Message is five. Oh God. Oh no. Harold, I'm a man of science and everything has an explanation. But have you ever experienced any ghost-like phenomena in the lab district recently? The other day I sure felt a presence sneak behind me. Oh dear. More corroborating in it. Evidence is needed. Oh, wait, I did the wrong thing. Messages from Sunny. Hun, her, hey, Harry, I was thinking about the, your alien fish friend. Clearly, you really care about them. You tell me if it was more than a normal pet. Right? She's. I did it again. She's jealous of a fish? Chris. Harold, my man! Say, my protein snacks from the TV lounge seem to have been snacked on. You know, those things aren't very good for you unless you're pumping iron too. Unless, did you start working out? If you don't train your body, you know what to ask. Uh huh. Camaro. Harold, what's with all the brightly colored crumbs on the lab table? Did the two of you stay up late again? I can't work in this mess. Get up with the cleaning. Okay, sorry. Shia. Hey Harold, no you must be busy, no worries, just wondered if you've seen my message, just wanted to run my new book idea by you. Who's Shia? I don't remember. Is it the person by the stage? So, it's a community based around the energy giving properties of the particles. Ah, Harold, join us. Hello you two. Hello. Hello. Where's the Go translator? Well, uh, yes. Uh, we get warmth in the air from them. And other things. Like food? Materials? And where do the particles come from? We aren't sure. There is a big glowing hole in the cave, but it feels very nice to be around, though. Harold, Maybe that's very curious. Earlier. 
What? I... Oh, oh Morel. I didn't really tell him. Not much changes back home. So, I suppose no one thinks much about them. Oy vey. We need to see this hole. I'd love to see it too. But how do we get there? You know the secret submarine. By the way, Professor, did you tell Wii U what you told me about the particles? I did. I suppose I owe Wii U here a thank you. My pleasure. I accept. Oh. Wii U, it's more like she means... I mean, let's retire for tea. No great plan was ever made without it. Good idea. Do, do, do they drink water? I like her little Here. place. Thank you. It smells great, like flowers. Yes, don't tell Cyrus. He's stressed enough as it is without worrying about me stealing <laughs> from his herbarium. Yeah, there's definitely a lot to keep track of. Like, whatever is going on with all water. Well, we don't know for sure. Only that they're hedging their bets on the launch procedure, and the CEO is acting strangely indeed. Oh. And then there's the light keepers. What's their plan in all this? Who knows? I'm wary, but at least they seem invested in the truth. Yeah. And that means for now, they're on our side, whoever they are. I guess so. Be nice if they stop with the graffiti, though. What's the latest with our start procedure, by the way? My, my. He does make you talk. Oh, no, he just has a good friend. I'm sure he'll iron out the problems he's having. A lot can be solved with him having a good friend. How do you feel about all this, Wii U? Oh, great. So much is going on. Oh, it's very exciting. And how about you, Harold? I'm just relieved we could help Wii U. Yes, you two clearly have a special bond already. Oh, uh, what is bond? Oh, it's something that keeps us close together. I was okay. like, let's put some hair oil in, brush my hair while I wait for this cutscene and no, put something we, else in my hair. It's <laughs> an invisible, emotional thing. Great. Nice to carry. Will you? Do you miss where you came from at all? Not really. I'll go back eventually, and that's okay. Well, I quite wondered if maybe you'd take Harold with you. Me? How? To the cave? Yes, to investigate the source of the particles. Of course, I want to go, but I can't just drop everything and people would notice me gone. But... me? And me. Oh. Don't worry, my boy. I'll be in close contact. And after all, haven't you been craving some adventure? Oh, sure, but... what if I get the adventure wrong? That's part You're of the just adventure! Observing, taking readings, letting Wii U show you how things work. You trust him, right, Wii U? Sure. There'll be lots of flimmelim to meet. Plenty of Malgaraha to see. <laughs> better flimmelim. Oh, that's a hard one to translate. It means... Someone <coughs> you can talk to. <coughs> Everyone back at the table. <coughs> but... I'm I'm so sorry. it means people like you. Oh, so... It's the name for your kind. No. It's all kinds. We've not needed any more detail before. And no one will mind if you don't call them Flimilim. Cool. It's just a bit confusing otherwise, don't, don't you think? <laughs> Not for us. Oh. We all have so many classifications for everything. That is true. Even a person can be male or female. Yeah, or I neither. Or so both. I suppose that's true. So or a little bit of one and a little bit of other, and it's a person? scale, it's a sliding scale, it's very fascinating. Don't worry about it. Just call us friends. Or our names. Okay, we will do. Great, then it's settled. Will you? You'll take Harold to explore the cave and meet the rest of the Flummelim. I can't believe it's going to be me <laughs> who sees it all for the first time. Yay. Oh, but... I can swim. I want how will come with me. Oh, hmm. Just follow hmm. me. I have a little something Is she to show the you owner guys. of this mysterious submarine? This mysterious taxi driver? Oh, wait. I wasn't allowed to come with them? How the hell does she. Maybe the lift only takes two. Yeah. 
Where did people go? Oh. Into the mysterious hole. Don't peek up under their skirt. Oh, stiff, oh, stiff. <gasps> she does have that submarine. Oh. Whoa. oh. I'd like to introduce you both to Jetsum, a little hobby project of mine. Used to be a space buggy meant for short range planetary surface analysis. And now it will be your means of visiting a very different kind of world. It's amazing. I'll look after it, I promise. Now, before you go, I've uploaded new firmware to your PDA. Okay. What does it do? Well, I developed an update to the translation software based on your discussions with Ryu for use with the PDA. So you don't have to schlep that huge machine around. Oh, neat. I call it Omnicom. Schlep also, it? You should both take one of these. Where does this go? In your ear. It's an earphone. It connects to the Well, PDA you're lucky so you that this -time translation. fishy has Plus, an ear at all. I need to stay in close contact with you. Very cool. And it'll work at long range? It should do. I developed a super efficient transmitter and new batteries for it all using some of Wii U particles. Wow. Yeah. Glad to help. It'll mean that whatever happens, you can stay in contact with me in some shape or form. That's and a bit worrisome. Yes, Professor? Do not lose it. <laughs> that toaster. These aren't easily replaced. I won't. I'll be careful. About everything. That should be everything you need. Hop in. Hop in. I'll be on the radio, and I'm sure you two will look after each other. We you. Let's go visit your home. Thanks, Professor. Good luck, you two, and have fun for me. Oh. Well. So, how does this work? Close the hut. Oh, I thought we will would be uh, outside. It's a snuggle eel. How does this, this stuff work? I think this panel shows. What happens if I push this? <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, come on, stop swerving. Ro will kill me if I dent her hobby project. What do you think the people do that sees you, though, through all the windows? Oh, Look at this. Seems like you're making it swim calmly now. Yeah. Whew. All these broken parts are just hovering. Less light. Less light means bad distance. It's called dark. And yeah, getting very hard to see. <laughs> oh. I know. It's chilly. Say, how did you find your way to the fedora? Mm, it wasn't easy. Dark and chilly. Don't like either. But once I had started, I just uh -huh. wanted to see what there was. I had to keep going. Oh. Next thing I knew, very light, less chilly, lots of owl. Then you shouting at me. When you tell it like that, it doesn't sound like a great experience. Worth it. Oh. Well, I'm glad it was worth it, and that you kept going. On that note, how are we going to get to your place? No worry, I can see. What, in the dark? No, it's more like mm, the right direction glows for me. Oh. Ooh. Everything on the fedora is signposted, so we don't even have to think about how to get somewhere. 
Glowing directions sound much more fun. So, you can direct me there? Yep. Oh. I can see the way clearly. So are we on the right path? The or? Sensors in the dark. I really don't want a lecture from Moreau. Okay, Wii U. You're the boss. Take us away. Take us away? That is a weird saying. Will they understand that? Take us away? We're almost there now. Be careful. The entrance tunnel is very narrow. Okay, I think I see it. Going to be a tight squeeze. What? Didn't look like a tight squeeze. Really here? Yep. This is the place. Good job. Oh, Cole. so they do also go in. Just have a short swim. Oh, I hadn't thought about that. Did you bring your swimmy Very pets? Short. It'll be fine. Let's go. Did you bring your swimming trunks? And. Oop. You could park closer, you <laughs> Can he swim? It's not like they go outside. Oh, Havul. Oh. Land. Finally. Land. Yeah. Oh, I'm on land. Real alien land. Yeah, he's always been in the just a bit of frog. Come on up. He's always been born and, and living so in that. Much rock. Real rock. Bumpy Aww. and slightly worn and Yes. Rock is okay. It's rock. Ah, oh, Wii U, it's just that the fedora. It's all metal. It's not real ground. I've never walked on anything made of real rock before. <laughs> okay. Would you like some? <laughs> I mean, sure, but thanks. Walking on it is kind of. Then you could always have your foot on a rock. Aww. Thanks, Wii U. Very soon. We'll get there. Wow. We're nearly there. I can't quite believe it. There. Oh, goodness me. Where? Wherever there is. Wow. What's going to be there? There is there where you are not. And here is here where it's you so are. It's cool to finally be here. I still can't quite believe it. It's exciting not knowing what I'm going to see next. It could be anything. And I'll be the first human to see whatever it is. And what... And maybe you see tons of other humans. Are you okay, Howell? This Ooh. is your home? Well, not my. Our. Oh, oh. Come on, we're not there yet. You want to see? Why didn't you bring a camera? You have a camera, we know that. So, this is the cave. <laughs> Whoa. Magical. So much space. We, what is everything? And where do you get food? What are your jobs? How does everything work? You'll see. One thing at a time. Well, so they do normally also walk then. Good to know. How do they get air? What are the odds that they're breathing the same air as a human? What about bacteria, Harold? You can actually, you know, poison the whole fedora. Well, you could have ki almost killed fishy several times over, so... Oh! No, 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 no! I want to poke that again! <gasps> oh, uh, Howell, I've got to take care of something, but I'll be back soon. Oh! Sure. Should I wait somewhere? 
Oh, yes. Opening at the waiting bench. Sounds cozy. <laughs> Hello. That means hi there. I thought it might. Tell them I say hi back. Will do. Okay, let's it's go. It's there for a time it's seeing an alien, home. right? Oh, look at this little, little good looking one. I wonder if it's polite to ignore people here. Maybe I should introduce myself. I don't want to get off on the wrong foot. So, uh, greetings. I offer you human greetings. Can't you just offer? Mm -hmm. Hmm. Is the translator not working? Let's see. Hello? Maybe it needs more calibrating. Or he's not really saying much. Come here often. We're not trying to pick them up. The weather. <laughs> Do you know Wii U? I mean, Might be a different I language. I haven't known Wii U for that long, but I do feel like we get each other. Same wavelength, you know? Yeah. Uh, what are they waiting for? So, what are you waiting for? Burp. Ah, that. Do we need to get through at all? That's the latest news in the cave, then. Not too talkative, or huh? Glip him. Okay. I refuse well, to come here often nice and weather. You. And like Moreau always said, never say more than you need to. Air and time are more precious than extra words. Oh, wow. Yeah. When I broke that bowl, it was a ball. It was a tone. Oh. Hi. Opa. Oh. I'm Harold. Nice to meet you. Hi. Oopa. Ah, I'm sorry. It was an accident. I'm just clumsy sometimes. No, no, no. no. Oopa. Yeah. A drop table. Oopa. You can also play music out by poking these. And that one. You're beautiful. We can't. There we go. Yeah, we're making music together. And the and the beat. We just came out over here to Jaya. Or am I missing something? Ooh, we can bang them against each other. And you... I have a little hard time seeing where they are. But I have no depth perception, so... Okay, well... Shall we just go? Mm -hmm. Task! Explore the cave. Hello? Well, I mean, we have someone here. Oh, hello. Is that a tap? Data check. Ah, translator needs some more calibration, I think. Data chum. Hello. Oh, hello. What's this place? Hmm. Can't understand you. Oh, um, am I talking too fast? What in the cave? Loud and slow as you want. Still talking nonsense to me. <laughs> Without an earpiece translator, it only works one way. I'll just be quiet, and maybe you'll have to explain. Wonder if you understand me. It's unusual. Lumbly glue? Or anything else? Oh, so I can lumbly glue here. Or. Oh, you do know Lumbly. Is he asking me for it or offering? Oh, sorry. Don't know what else to say. This booth is fascinating. 
But I think I better try it again with Wii U. Like, uh, what's he doing with his hand? And new drawing. Oh, Harold, your drawing skills. We have something here. Don't fall off the cliff, Harold. Oh. Okay. Follow that person. Why is there somebody? Why aren't it? Why didn't you bring like test tubes and stuff? I'm sure you can have a little piece. Can have some to try. Oh, what are they doing here? What in the world are they doing? Maybe it's a filter. Maybe it creates air. We don't know. Because... Wait. They, we can understand them. Let's see. Oh, and that one is having a... Well, this person is having a bath. No, no, don't touch it. Please be careful. It's all very sensitive still at the moment. Yeah, don't touch, Harold. I never said you would touch. I said you would, like, try and talk to them. I'm surprised no one is, like, saying anything. They're all treating him very... Uh, well, you just stepped into this dude's bath! Hi. So, um, what are these things? Blue pad. Uh, what do you say? Uh, yeah, they're not going to be able to understand me. It's supposed to be quiet here anyway. Oh, okay. Just sit and glupo. I wonder what glupo is. Or art. Maybe the things in the nooks? I don't know why you're talking in gibberish. But please, shh. Oh, they have the same. Oh, I guess it's important to be quiet here. Out of respect. Harold, maybe? shut up! Shh. I start to understand the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy where they thought that humans, maybe they just need to talk with their mouth or they die because they say so much unnecessary stuff. Okay. I mean, if everybody's loud in a cave, there's gonna be so many echoes. Okay, we can't come go to them. We can come up there. Um Okay. You mean need like some sort of hello signal, Harold? Hi. Here. Yeah. Oh. Thank you so much. Fish in a bubble. Uh, were we supposed to do that? Oh, oh no, kids. Oh. Hello there, little ones. Yes, Hello. come on, this way. Hello. Follow us with tactility. Okay. You look fabulous. I love your coloring. <laughs> Follow the little alien. Okay. Is it a football? No. Is it a game? Okay. Do I get to control? Okay, I want to stand on this one. Uh-huh. 
That looked cool. Like this? Okay. <laughs> Push out. Did we do it right? Did we do it wrong? Oh, 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 F follow your thingy. Oh, gosh, I hope I'm not being super rude somehow. We seem to be dancing, kind of. I can't move, so... Oh! Another one? If I just copy them, how bad can it be? I mean, worst case, you do graffiti. For all we know, they're doing graffiti and all the adults are like, No! What are you doing? Oh. Oh, no. Am I... Are they... Is, is this... Is it what? What do you think is happening? <laughs> Good I'm question. Getting a greeting ritual badly wrong? <laughs> no. You're just playing around with those cheeky kids. I think they love you now. Oh. So, I'm not offending everyone? Well, you're not exactly being polite. But I think everyone is pleased to laugh at the funny alien. Hang on. <laughs> Do you remember Pineapple Helga? Of course. Such pointy hair. And lovely long shoes. Is it like when the mini yetis did the snowball dance? Yes. They would have kept on doing the tickle to kitty anyway, but then they were glad to have someone new to show it to. Uh, okay, I think I, I don't, know. but I, I mean, glad they had fun. A bit about how you all think. Yes, you'll get there. Just like when Helga has to imitate a seal to get to the ice cave. Will you? Can I ask you something? Of course. Did you tell them I was coming? It's going to oh. be a lot easier if I just show you around before trying to answer. Come on. Okay. Hi there. Hey there, Chick. Hi. Could you give my friend here a little something? Sure. The blue will be okay. Here you go. Uh, will you? Mm, no. Give him the blooper dupe. Thanks, will you? This one looks much better. Go on. Um, go on to do. Feed the cow out. Oh, man. Right there. Yeah, but you did it before, Alan. Come with. Come with. Uh. Okay. <clears throat> Didn't do that last time. And now watch. Oh, trust me, I will. So we tie the uh, poisy like so. And oh, you fish? Then bubble fish. Wow, that's how you fish? Yep, bubble fish. Oh, but I mean, wait, you spend the fish to get a fish? What do 
That is weird. Uh, never mind. So, we have... I have a question. And I have an answer. But you don't know what the... <coughs> not this time it's not. I don't get the purpose of using a fish to make a rope to then catch another fish with? Uh -huh. You can see why, right? Yes, but things just work like that here. It's not always how it looks. So what huh? is going on? Hmm, how to explain? Things work in cycles. Maybe having a fish isn't the same as getting a fish. When we turn something into something else, it's not just the old thing and the new thing. There is a thing that escapes. We call it the new men. It is a something that is nothing. But it's important to have. Right. So something is also nothing, and nothing can be a something? Hidemo. Just like I said. Maybe you should have sent this cool kid that was interested in philosophy. I'm just saying. Are we saying that what happened with the fish was more like the act of catching the fish? That's what we were doing? Ah, what's this one? Um, well, the zoop zoop, yes. Are you hungry? I'm a bit peckish, yeah. Is there somewhere nearby? Yes, here. Yes, yes, you see. What's happening now? Well, it's... Uh, the result is lumbly do. Oh, right. Of course. Very tasty. Let's enjoy. Oh, I will. But uh, shouldn't we pay or something? No, we don't really pay here. The food is free? It's not free. Because it's all free. We help each other, and yeah, good idea. eventually it all evens out. No one really keeps track anyway. Wow, that's such a simple system. Didichik, glad to see you enjoy. Always good to Didichik with a new <gasps> Oh I'm no, Harold! Fish. I'm human. They I'm might be calmness. A human. Fish, human, numberly glue. Ha, <laughs> I see. Thanks. I can't wait to try it. Bye. I wanted to see if you liked it. Yeah! Let's eat. This looks surprisingly delicious. Yes. It's very healthy because of the minerals in the pond. And the blalo neither. And then... Yeah, Harold. <clears throat> what? Yes. Yum. It's good for you. Harold? Are you okay? I'm no, so he's high as a kite. I zoned out, but I'm super okay. There's just so much that is so new. It's a bit overwhelming. Malgaraha. Was that a yawn or a fishy word? Oh, oh. I thought you were watching the... Well, it's like the way the light reflects from the ripples in the clear water on the cave walls and reminds you of a good time with a friend. Aww. A bit like now? Precisely. I see what you mean. It's beautiful. I see something similar in the herbarium sometimes, but I never really had anyone to share it with. Oh, Harold. This is what friends are for. It's so crazy here, Wiyu. Amazing. But so different. It's pretty cool that we can understand each other at least. Oh, yes. I think so. But maybe you can't understand a lot of our things. Oh, and That's... you understand everything human? Well, yes. <laughs> are so unpredictable and complicated. There is almost nothing to understand. Like the all-water tube system. I was going to say fizzy bubbles, but okay. Yeah. And so, you really don't have money here? No. Okay. That's the one thing I really don't get about humans. Well, it's just a trade thing, but you can trade really easily with it. But some people have more than others. Why is that? Um, 
Some people are more important? Um, no. Between what is important? Um, take Moreau. She's cleverer than anyone. We all need her science. Oh, but her science wouldn't mean anything without everyone else to use it. Yes. Yeah, this is making my head hurt. Then let's go. Next part of the tour. I feel you, Harold. The whole spacing out thing. Is this place? I really couldn't figure it out. It's a library. What? Oh, there aren't any books. Not all the books. Osmosbo. Ryu, I'm gonna need a bit more of a translation. Okay. It's just that. So, Osmos is just knowing. That's the best I can do. And Osmosbo are those jellies. You can just know through them. Wow. So it's like a book you don't have to read. Yes, but I don't Aww. really know how they... I mean, how to explain how they work. Okay, cool. So... Imagine that. A library with bath. More to see. Interesting concept. I love reading in a bath. Yes, this thing. So, what are they doing? Aha. Uh -huh. Just wait. They're building something? Oh, or maybe it's going to be a kind of game. Very soon now. You're here. Oh, okay. I think I get it. It's nice, isn't it? I call it drum. The, the song? Or the style of music? Well, neither yeah. really. The way we make music is more... in the moment. So, they don't practice? Is it a jam? <laughs> must be your host. Yes, but it's also the word we use for when music is, um, improvised. Like, made up there and then. Well then, yes. That, with people watching, is thrum. Right. Well, whatever it is, I love it. And I love jam. Oh. I wish we'd brought some. Harold, are you there? Oh, hi, Professor. How are you doing? What? I'm fine. Where are you? Just had some lunch. There's lots to see. Harold, I'm quite sure there is. But may I remind you, you're yeah. <laughs> on holiday. Uh, I know. The particles. I'll get right on it. Speak to you soon, Professor. Good luck, Harold. Don't do anything I would do. Over and out. <laughs> Ryu, that was Moreau. Reminding us to check out the particles. Ah, uh, yes. Right this way. I love the fabric of their dress. Well, their their clothes. Their apron? I don't know. Oh, could we have gone here? This must feel so nice for Harold. So different from his spaceship. Find the source of the. <coughs> okay. Do you, do you bring something, Harold? Here we are. It's beautiful. So cool. I don't think cool is the word, but okay. Again, if you had a camera, Harold. 
Don't fall down. So, what happened to the other Flumalun that tried to go down there? Are there others? Oh, uh, what, what do you mean? Well, has it anyone tried going down there before? No, no. It's just there. They don't seem super no curious, usually. Used for energy. They come up. Why would we go down? To find out what's down there. Maybe you could bring up loads of particles at once. But we don't need more particles at once. <laughs> so, it's never been explored? Well, well, I suppose there was that one Flumulan kid who explored it. What? And what did they say? Not much. He never came back. We assume he's happy down there. Oh, dear. And now that I think about it, there was one older Flumulan who went or fell down. Oh, maybe they're still down there together. Okay. I think I'm gonna call Moreau now. Wow. How do you Not like this thing? Much curious. Harold, is that you? Oh, hi, Professor. How are you doing? What? <laughs> you found the particles. Oh, hi, Professor. Wii U says hi, by the way. And yes, we found them. They're coming from a giant hole in the ground. You get down there. Well, we use says a couple of flumalim have been down before, but they never came back. It looks kind of deep. Okay, don't try and go down <laughs> there, Harold. Is there anyone or thing there with more information on the hole? There is a kind of library, but there is or there isn't. What's the <laughs> She sounds a bit flustered. Books are jelly. So the library. I don't care if the books are jelly or <laughs> Find some more information on it you can bring back. Okay, Professor. Wish me luck. You could just have said, like, um, she could have visited and they could just have faked that she had a tummy ache or a migraine. I mean, again, why did we bring vials? Sample bags. Why can't we run? Well, I mean, I'm not sure, sure maybe Harold should run. I think he will fall and trip very easily. Or trip and fall, sorry. I'm getting tired. Okay. Last thing we do this session is the library. Revisit the library. Hello again, librarian. <laughs> I was wondering, do you have any jellies on the crack with the particles? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, he's new. He says, Do we have any jellies about the glowing hole? Oh, I believe so. You may need to test a few. I've not really labeled them. <laughs> They're so relaxed. So, uh, how do just I just touch them? them? Slurp them? It's hard to Lick explain. Them? But just hold one close to your head and be calm. And not try too hard. A bit like how memories work. Okay. Is there any way to know what each jelly is about? Just give any of them a go. I'm sure they're all full of great stuff. Yeah. Oh! It didn't like being red. Will you? Can you show me? Uh, um, wow! More fun if you figure it out for yourself. So, I'd love to, another probably person messy. that wants I us to be electrocuted. To her before she gets annoyed and puts me on shelf duty again. So, Wii U, how do I read these things? Oh, how long? Oh, actually, I can't. If it's hard to explain, I'll just watch. Read. Oh, I can't understand the jellies. What? But you explained it to me. Yes. Well, we all know the theory. Oh, that's okay. You know, 
I'm not great with human books. Half the time, the letters and the words seem to rearrange themselves. Um, can I just encourage you? When your mind feels Maybe like none of them can. Stick your nose into it and remember what's in the jelly. Sure thing. We'll figure it out together. Let's give this a shot. Let's save that for next time. Yeah, just give it a, make it a cliffhanger, shall we? Thank you so much for watching Harold Halibut, and I see you next time. Bye.